wildlife charity Butterfly Conservation is calling on everyone to get involved in the big butterfly count, which starts tomorrow. But what exactly is it? Well, Dr Zoe Randall is the lead scientist on the project and she joins me here today. Hey, Dr Zoe. Hi, good morning. Good morning. Now, explain to me, what exactly is the Big Butterfly Count? The Big Butterfly Count is the annual survey of butterflies across the UK that members of the public can get involved in. It's great fun to do with your friends and family. It runs from tomorrow until the 6th of August. And all you need to do is spend 15 minutes in a warm, sunny spot and count the butterflies that you see and the different types. There's a really good identification guide that you can download from the website to help you identify what you're looking at and there's also a free smartphone app as well with the guide on there. That sounds pretty exciting and also pretty straightforward but what exactly should we be looking for then? Well there's 20 different species, um, target species, 17 butterflies, three day fly moths and you just literally need to go out into your garden or your local park, countryside, churchyard, anywhere from shoreline to mountain top, spend 15 minutes in a warm sunny spot and count the butterflies you see. Now, we've heard a lot about butterfly species being endangered here in the UK. What exactly is going on? Well, climate change and habitat loss are driving the changes that we're seeing in our butterflies. And 80% of the UK butterfly species are declining um, and have been since the 1970s. So it's quite worrying. So by taking part in the big butterfly count, you can really help us um, generate valuable data and information to help us understand what's happening to our butterflies. Now, Dr Zoe, I've got a big question for you, which might be quite an impossible one, but what is your favourite species of butterfly? My favourite species of butterfly is the brimstone. The males are bright yellowy green, and when I see the first one in the spring, it tells me that the winter is over and the spring's here and the long, hot, sunny summer days are coming. So a real beacon of hope and joy. Oh, I love that. Essentially, a big reminder that actually we've got good times coming and good weather too. Absolutely. <laughs> well, Dr Zoe, thank you so much for joining me today on the New John Sofa. You're welcome. Thank you.